Hi, I'm the number one hazard and I'm going to show you how to really pimp your computer's appearance to the limits. As you can see, I love my desktop. It is awesome. I have this lovely rocket dock down here which allows me to put anything down there. My little widgets down the side here, all around, without having any icons on my little iPhone. I also love my alien taskbar. It is awesome. I can fit anything down there. I can go where, wherever I need to with that. So I'm just going to show you how to actually make your computer look like this. So as you can see, the wallpaper, you can easily download that off the internet from Google Images. T just type in Apple wallpapers and just click on this one. This one is awesome. As you can see, it's got this lovely little wave coming out of the Apple logo. And uh, all these different scenes down here. These are all called Yahoo widgets. They actually have all different widgets plus many more you can download off the net. Uh, the widgets are so great, you can use anything with them. Things like controlling iTunes, like here, the iPhone one, which also controls it. You've got your clocks and your batteries and your, and your digital clocks and your photo slideshows and the like. You can download any from yahoowidgets.com.au. And also, this rock dock down here is also. It's actually called the Alienware Object Dock. It actually, as you put any programs down here, and if you go like this over it, it's really cool. It sort of lights up all the programs. It's like Safari, Instant Explorer, my computer, my documents, Camtasia Studio, Cam Studio, and with your monitors and clocks and stuff down there. So I'm going to show you how to actually install this. I'm going to go my my. Oops. I want to go to my computer. So basically, you just you'll just find that as the things are loading, it's gonna do a little bit of a rock down here. Um, it takes a little while because obviously it uses up quite a lot of RAM. Um, as you see, you've got your little icons as well, like this. I love it. Um, okay, so I'm just gonna show you the install packages. So it's actually called what I've used to make the theme is Alienware Theme Manager. You install this, and what this does is I'll show you it now actually. It's a program that allows you to make the start menu and sounds and everything. It's called Alien G U I S E. I don't know what the S E stands for, but I know it's Alien Graphics User Interface. And so you can change it from your normal Windows XP desktop to five others. Plus you can download more off Alienware's website. The one I'm using at the moment is Xenomorph. You can actually change, this is the real one, I've changed the desktop wallpaper and stuff. It also allows you to have different icons as well and sounds and the theme as I said. So you just you just click apply and it'll take about a few minutes to change everything but yeah it's great. So um, you can also, I've also got a few other things here as well. Um, Windows 7 transformation pack turns everything into Windows 7. A Windows Vista transformation pack, um, another Windows 7 pack for some reason. Um, different types of cursors, like I'm using the Aero one. I basically put a bit of Mac, Vista, XP, and Alienware into this. Um, you've also got the um, the Yahoo widgets also, so I'll just get them for you. So the Yahoo widgets are right here. Um, I'm just going to copy this here, so I can show you how it actually copies. So when you copy it. It actually copies like this. Well, actually, you couldn't see them. I'll show you now. And I have to copy the install file. So go down to wherever Yahoo Widgets is. Yahoo Widget Engine, this is what it's called. You can download it from Yahoo's website. Um, it downloads pretty fast, around half a megasecond. So um, only 15 megs this file. So that's good. Um, so I'm just going to arrange the icons. So there you go. Um, there you go, you've got your Yahoo widgets, what, your Yahoo widget engine, here we are. So you install that, and that is what all of this downside, and this, and this, and this, and this is, and this. And this, this dock down here is actually for the Alienware, it is actually. It's the Alienware's dock, it's like an object dock, it allows you to, you can change it. So basically what I have done is I have incorporated uh, XP, Vista, Alienware, and Apple. So on my desktop, and I'm gonna keep it like this for as long as I need to. I love it. It's it's really good. Um, high performance. You need a fair fair load of RAM and CPU because as you can see, it uses a fair load of RAM. I've already used 50 meg. 
uh, sorry, 50% of my RAM, which is quite a lot, um, out of my 4 gig. Okay, so you've also got your CPU. Mine using at the moment 73%. It's around, um, and oh, that's just my hard drive. But anyway, um, it, it just it, it it the box really good. It shows you all the different things of what you're doing, and you've also, you know, you got your little widgets down the side. I'll I'll also on my website. Um, I'll put that on as well. I'll also incorporate instructions to install everything. Um, if you need any help, just uh, email me at um, my email address, which I've also put on my YouTube website as well. So, um, thank you for watching this, and I hope you do the same as what I've done.